Well, it's not even December yet, and look what we have on our hands here. Got our first snow. I know somebody that wants to go out there and see it. Let's go. Go ahead. What is that, rocks? You remember this from before? Uncover all your toys. There's one there. She's like, where's my football? Where's my favorite toy? Go eat your football. Do you remember where it is? Where's your football? <laughs> oh, you knew it. You knew where your football was. Awesome. Hey, let's go get the chirps. Let's go get the chirpies. Come on. Well, it definitely seems a little bit early for the snow, but I guess anything's possible when you live in Pennsylvania. It's still November and it's not quite winter yet, but it's like winter out here. And it's kind of nice, I guess, to enjoy the different seasons. And, you know, you get a little taste of everything living in this area. You get the hottest of hot and the coldest of cold, and you definitely get some snow. So let's see what the chirpy dudes are up to today. This will be their first experience in the snow. Come on, let's let them out, Rex. Okay. Match this up here. Let's get some video of them coming out here. Come here, guys. There comes a rooster. <laughs> Usually they come running right out of here. Well, that's not going to help. You can't go in there. Here, let's open the door up. It's winter time, guys. Come on. Come on, chicka chicka chickers. Let's see who's brave. This is like the first time I let him out ever. No one really knew what to do. Come on, guys. Hey, chicka chicka chickers. <laughs> Look at these guys. You guys afraid to come out in the snow? Got their corn. Here, guys. You guys want corn? I seriously can't even get you out of there with corn. Come here. Come here, chickies. I know you're out. Believe it or not, I couldn't even get those chickens out with corn. They are opposed to the snow. I really thought it'd be funny to see them out here, but I guess I'll have to wait and see if I can lure them out later. In the meantime, I got some other things to take care of here. And this is another thing that kind of sucks about winter is the uh, water, the chicken water gets kind of icy and I have to replace it. What I've been doing is switching these out. I bring the frozen one in. You can see this one's pretty pretty solid for the most part. They can still get water out of there, but this has been frozen the past couple days. And then I switch it out with this other one that I have. This is a larger one. So I just rotate them in and out each day and allow the other one to thaw out so I don't have to deal with breaking the ice out and possibly damaging it. Well, I'll just leave you in here. You guys can come out whenever you want. Next, we'll go up and see how pork chop's doing. I got my new water bucket here. It's a Tidy Cats container. I almost fell, but uh, this trek definitely gets a lot worse in the winter time, that's for sure. Even though it's technically not winter yet, it's still fall. News to me. There she is. Hey, buddy, what are you doing? Hey, poor chap. How'd you make out in the snow? Looks like you've been out and about today. Here, let's go down and get you some water. Come on. Come on. Oh, what do we got going on down here? This, here's your water. Here's your food. Oh boy. We still got some food under all that snow. Yeah, you're on video. You're on video. Here, let's see what we got going on here. Frozen dirty water. Nasty. Let's get you some good water here, Chop. Let's see if I can do this while I'm filming. She goes nuts on this water when I put it in here. Oh boy. Don't, don't recommend doing this one-handed. Okay. <laughs> okay. How's that? Try some water? I don't know about your... Oh boy. You just dumped your food. Nothing new there. I'm going to get you some fresh food too, okay? Alright, Chop. Here's the good stuff. You might want to get out of your bowl. Get out of your bowl. Get a bunch of this. There you go. That should be good. I noticed she likes it sort of like an oatmeal. So I take some water that I have left over and I dump that in just to kind of mix it around a little bit. And then that'll absorb in. She likes it kind of, kind of like an oatmeal texture as you can see the other stuff in there was. 
I'm sure as she dumps it in the snow, it'll be all over the ground. So she's a happy pig now and she's got her food and she's got her water. Look at you, what are you doing? Where's your stick? Where's your stick? That's pretty ambitious, Rox. Get it. Get your stick. This stick's like 20 feet long. Come on, bring it with you. Bring it with you. Bring it with you. Come on. We gotta go. Come on. <gasps> She's been trying to get that stick for like a week. Come on, Rox. Come on, bear. Come on. Snow dog. Come on. Come on. The good thing about pork chop is I ended up putting another half a bale of straw in her coop last night. So I'm sure she was nice and warm and she obviously was doing okay this morning. So I'm happy about that. Happy my chickens are okay. But now it's time for some fun. Get your football. Bring it here. Drop. Good girl. There she goes. Drop. Good girl. We finally have a brave soul. You're brave. No one else is coming out. There's a rooster, see if I can zoom in on him. He's like, what are you doing, crazy? Hey, chick chick. Here's what you get for being brave. You want some corn? <laughs> see, it pays to be the brave one. You get the corn all to yourself. There you go. How's that for you? Thanks for watching my snowy video and we're gonna have more videos up here soon.